Good morning. Me and Dan are out again this morning. Um, today we are going to try to do a little traverse from the Bear Lake, Pinnacle Lake area over to the top of Mount Pilchuck and then back down the Mount Pilchuck Trail. So I think this is known as um, the East Ridge of Mount Pilchuck or we could call it Pinnacle Lake to Mount Pilchuck Traverse. So this is where we're starting out at the Bear Lake, Pinnacle Lake Trailhead. I have never been here before. Dan did this in the winter when it was all snowy and said it was pretty cool. So we'll see how it is when we're bushwhacking um, and probably rockier on the ridges today. We'll see how it looks. pretty little pond area on the way to Pinnacle Lake. So, only a short ways past that first pond, here we are at Pinnacle Lake. It's probably pretty low for how hot and dry it's been most of the summer, but a pretty spot. We're gonna make our way over, kind of around these boulders, and then shoot up a gulch that way to get on top of that ridgeline backside. And then we're gonna follow the ridgeline all the way above Lake 22 and Heather Lake over to Pilchuck. Well, I'd say we're more than halfway up now, the second part of the gully up from the lake. But uh, this is uh, longer and steeper than it looks from down below. It kind of reminds me of a rockier version of Headley Pass over on Vesper. Which right now, when we're looking across, we're looking at Glacier Peak, Dickerman, Big Four, Vesper straight across from us. Pretty nice view. I know it's a little uh, small on this camera. Working our way up to the ridge. Yeah, made it to the top of the gully. So we just topped out at the top of Iodine Gulch. This is painted for people coming the other direction. Pretty cool. Nice view across the valley. So right after coming out on top of Iodine Gulch, this is the backside you start to come down. And again, I know it's small on my camera, but really good view all across the valley. Um, where my finger's at is Lake Stevens and Everett right out there. And again, you know, I can't really see it now, but Pilchuck's right over that way. So we got to traverse down a little bit, back up the ridge. Thank you. 
this area up here, I think Dan said it was called It's pretty awesome area. It's just everywhere you go, you're surrounded by awesome granite, stone, and little lakes and ponds everywhere. And then looking straight out, you got Mount Rainier out above the ponds. The whole backside up there that we just came over, there were another like five or six ponds up there. It's just like another little mini enchantments. Dan and I were saying this is actually, we think, prettier than Gothic Basin. the gully and we are now right where the main trail heads up the lookout is just up there Sounds about right. <laughs> Took us three hours, 45 minutes. 